G'day, it's James here from Espresso Resto. Today I thought I'd bring a bit of magic to one of our videos. So we're going to see what we can magic up by combining a Ranchilio Silvia with a Ranchilio Rocky Grinder. So here we go and I'm going to cast my spell, Arabica Robusta. Wow, a Ranchilio Lucy. So this is the Ranchilio Lucy, which is essentially a Ranchilio Rocky Grinder combined with a Sylvia. It is in a, a, a lot, much sort of larger frame, um, but it has all of the same fundamentals, boiler, grinder, burrs, tank, um, porter filters, group, buttons, everything's pretty much the same. So what we might do is just step through a few of these things here. So at the back, we've got our water tank just like we do on the Sylvia. Here we've got our bean hopper and it's the same hopper capacity as the Rocky grinder and that is adjustable in terms of grind fineness by depressing this little button here and being able to twist the bean hopper. And then to grind into the porter filter, all you need to do is um, push the porter filter in against this button here below the, the spout and out will come coffee. Over here, I'll put that out of the way. Over here, we've got our usual Sylvia controls, power on, and then we've got our uh, brew button, hot water button, and the steam button. Again, the same situation with the Sylvia. When you want steam, you have to switch it on to uh, get the thermostat, um, to the boiler to go up to the steam pressure. We have a version one um, Sylvia steam knob here and a version one steam wand being the one that swivels just in the one plane and not a ball jointed one. I'm sure you could retrofit a ball jointed one if you are keen. There's a very large drip tray down here, which is accessible underneath. Um, it's all plastic covered in, which is good because I'd suggest that that probably helps avoid some of the corrosion issues you used to get with the, um, the Sylvia's underneath the drip trays. So that's a good, good thing here. Um, it is mounted on these legs here, so it is quite tall. So I think, why don't we get on and make a coffee? So I've got the uh, brass 58 millimeter porter filter here. It's got the double spout. Um, it's got a sort of a splash guard on the spout. Let's lock that away. Get that in. Get a cup underneath there. And again, brew button. Steady uh, extraction here. It's looking pretty good. And depending on how strong you like it, that's about right for me. There we go. Now, so next step would be the steam. So we're going to flick the steam on so that the boiler heats up. So as we have with the Sylvia, we've got a pretty big brass boiler in there. So that generates quite a lot of steam and you'll see here how quickly we rev this milk up. So let's have a go. So on it goes. There is, I find quite a lot of steam right at the start. It really comes out like a bit of a, a jet. I mean, sometimes it might be worth just purging that first little bit of steam out. So you have a bit more control when you're doing the steaming. So I'm pretty much there now. Certainly a little faster than my little Seiko, but it's not quite at that consumer speed. So it's a bit easier to manage, which is good. So it's a good compromise, I think. And that's, that's done. So we'll give that a, knocked. So now for the pour. Again, I, I feel very judged when I do this these days. They, all, all these guys watching. I'm no barista, but I try my best. So that was the Ranchilio Lucy. Now it is, a, it's a big unit. So it does, it does take up a bit more space, I reckon, than, than the Sylvia and Rocky. Certainly it's a bit taller. So if you're a bit limited in the kitchen, for space, it may be not ideal, but one convenient thing is having it all in the one unit, it's just a bit easier to clean. You're not having to clean in between things where the grind sometimes spill out on the ground. And look, you're getting all of the features of both very capable Aranchilio machines in the, the Sylvia and the, the Rocky. So I, I really like this one. This particular one is for sale at the moment. And I get them in from time to time. These are getting, um, 
on a bit, but they are still such a good machine. So if you're looking for something interesting, try the Lucy. And in the meantime, remember to keep caffeinated. <laughs>